Alright guys, so we got our Logan Berry. We're gonna be planting them. So we're gonna take it out of our shed. Okay, these are our Logan Berries. Yeah. And then we're gonna get our tools. Yeah. Hey guys, so we, we're gonna be planting our Logan Berry. So we're gonna get out of our shed. And we're gonna get our tools. Yeah, guys. Okay. Okay, guys. So this is our tool shed. So we're gonna be coming. We're gonna be entering this. Uh, yeah, entering <laughs> it thing, opening, and we're just gonna get our um our garden shovel to to help us plant our loganberry. Yeah, and we're gonna get our rake, and we're gonna get our little mini rake, and now we're gonna go um plant our loganberries and give you guys some facts about it. Yeah. Okay, guys. So um, we have our Logan berries, and we're gonna be planting them where these holes are by our blackberry vines. Yeah. These are start from Stark Bros. These, these are, are from Stark Bros. And we're gonna be planting one, so you can get started. Okay. So we're gonna take out our plant, and I'm just pushing from the bottom. Oh. I'm gonna grab it. Did you already make your hole? Yeah, yeah we made our hole. holes here. We're gonna maybe you should put her here. This one. Yeah. And then uh, I'm just gonna spread the roots out a little bit uh, over the dirt. And I'm just gonna open them a little bit so they can spread. That's good, right? Yeah, as long as you get the edges. That's good. Okay. Make sure the always make sure, yeah, make sure when it goes down, the top is flat with the dirt. Then you know you're not too deep. Okay. And then we cover it? Yep. We're gonna push it down. Push. Uh -huh. Guys, and these the Logan berries are like a dark red. And they're kind of like uh, the, like the size of a blackberry, but they have a color, it's a dark red. Yeah. And what is a Logan berry? A Logan berry is um cross between a blackberry and a raspberry and we're so excited guys because um because we we always wanted to try them and it's the first time growing them yeah because there was um six and now there's five i'm gonna just complete the three she can do this We got these in Thornless, or they they are just Thornless. Yeah, cause we um we don't like the ones where it pokes, cause it's kind of a little harder to get. So yeah, we we hurt, prefer huh? the Thornless. Yeah. And yeah. the good thing is that they came with big the, scratches. Huh? Yeah. The thorns give you these big scratches. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we actually have a wild blackberry back there on that trellis right there, but it has a bunch of um, thorns on it, so I had to take it out. And it comes with the label, so. That's a good thing to remember what it is. We recently um, put our blackberry vines on our new chalices, guys. And we made this new landscape just to plant the Logan berries and the blackberry vines. Yeah. And then again, guys, you open the roots edges right there. okay guys so um I almost buried this new growth um um little stem there and um if you see that guys make sure you don't bury it like I almost did Push. Okay, and then third one. And guys, as you can see, there's one right here. There's one right here. 
Oh yeah. Nice. Over the dirt. Is that your homemade worm castings right there? Mm, where'd it go? I don't know. Yeah. There he is. <laughs> okay. Look at the cutest little leaves. Yeah. Okay, so it's your turn. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to do what she did. You just push it from the bottom. Mm -hmm. So guys, so you just grab the, um, the, um, the, uh, the berry out, and then you, um, you loosen up the roots. Very gently, huh? You very gently, because you don't want to shock them. Okay. This should be good. And then I'm just going to make this hole a little deeper. Wait, where's that other shovel? Can you give me that other shovel? Thanks. So I'm just going to make this hole a little deeper, guys. Yeah. We have been working don't, so... Don't let it fall over the rocks. We have been working so hard in our garden, guys. We made this new landscape not so long ago. Um, a few days ago, actually. Position your plants. Okay, guys, so that was the first looking berry that I planted. Now I'm going to go on with my second one. Is your hole deep enough first? No, I have to get a little deeper. Guys, we put the white woods here to um, um, block the walkway right here to pick berries and from our garden um, a garden bed, so. There we go, guys, and now on to my last one. That's great, too. Thanks. The setup is so nice and easy to plant, huh? Yeah, it's very easy to plant. I wonder what they'll taste like. Yeah. Maybe the taste is um, similar to blackberries or raspberries. Maybe. Mm, I'm gonna find out. <laughs> oh, this is a 
the prop guys. And there we go guys, our Logan berries are planted. And I hope they have great success in yeah. growing so that we can try it because we never tried it and we always wanted to. Yeah. Can you not put the label on it? Yeah. And then guys, the third step is to water them. Yes, guys, that's the most important step. Yeah. So I'm gonna be watering them. Guys, so this is kind of like um, like a berry land, like a berry landscape. Yeah. Where you'll find many berries, blackberries, Logan berries, and many more. <laughs> many treasures. Guys, it's awesome to grow your own fruit because, like, when it's summertime and like when all your trees are mature, you can just like grab one. Fruit, guys. Yeah. Do you want one of yours? Is it time for a refill or we got plenty of water? We got plenty of water. I don't think it's good. There we go. There we go. So we had to refill some wa with, this, with some water. Just an extra little juzzle for the extra little juzzle for them. And there we go, guys. Our Logan berries are planted. Yeah. And what's good is that you can keep these for another plant if you're growing it by seed. Recycle, huh? Yeah, recycle. you can recycle, and like if you want to grow like um, just anything yeah. from seed, you can just put it in there. Which we will do shortly, huh? Mm. Which we will do, probably in the next two videos. <laughs> Good job, girls. Thanks, Mom. Okay, so we planted our Logan berries on February 2nd, 2023. February 2nd, 2023, guys. That's, yeah. a, that's a good planting journal for us. <laughs> <laughs> guys, we have many thing, many more things to plant, like cotton candy, apron. Oh, that's food. next, huh? Yeah, yeah, that's probably be in our next video. Is the cotton candy apron. And then we also... Are we going to plant that today, Mom? Yes. Okay, so we'll plant cotton candy apron today. So stay tuned, guys. Okay guys, so this is our cotton candy apron and we're going to be planting it um, right there, but this is the label of it. Aprium, it means it's an apricot and a plum. Yeah. And one. And, uh, so, sure. aprium uh, is more of an apricot tasting, more than a plum. People say it's really good. There's also a plum cot, which is more plum than an apricot. Okay, guys, so, um, but the apricot, I mean, the aprium is more apricot than plum, but if you got the plum cot, it's more plum than apricot. So, there's two, like, ways you can get them. So, we're just going to be planting them now. Yeah, we got them from Stark Bros too. Okay guys, so we're shoveling the dirt. Okay. 
Because the root um, itself is in that. Um, that deep. Show the root. Because yeah. it, was, it was a bare yeah. root tree, right? Yeah. This is oh, the. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's because. Of the bare root. Ibrium. Yeah, it. it was soaked already for 15 minutes. It still to me smells like gas out here. It does. It does. Oh, maybe because not the um blue blow yesterday. No. Oh. Okay, you want mom to do a little bit now? Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. We got broom. Too deep, huh? Yeah. All right. Let's add a little bit more dirt. So we added the soil, more soil, guys, because a little too deep. So now I'm just smoothing it out with the plant. Doing Johnson smoothing it out. Um. I think that's going to be perfect. What do you girls think? I think so. Yeah. Now we're going to position how we want the tree. Yeah. So we're going to position how we want our tree. Which way looks? What way do you think looks good? Right there. Yeah, me right there. Okay. okay. Somebody has to hold it while somebody dumps the dirt on top. Mom's gonna help us um, smooth the root, smooth the dirt out. So you don't want to bury this piece here. You don't want to bury that piece there because it needs to be breathe. Right, mom. Right. Because it needs uh, it'll get rotten and mold and die. Yeah, because um, mom is helping us um, smooth out the dirt, but you don't want to cover um, um, that piece right there. I don't know if you guys can see it. There. <laughs> and so, because, oh guys, look, we found some worms. But we, so you don't want to um, cover it because it'll get rotten and mold. Yeah. That piece right there. Just a little bit. Guys, so this is how it turned out. So I'm just going to be watering our cotton candy um, apron. Yeah. You just want to gently water it. Give it a nice good soaking. Give it a nice good soaking. Mmm. That is fine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> ASMR. We just want to put a lot. We want to put a lot because we want it to be nice and disgusting. <laughs> yeah. It's so good there because you need to soak it. So the roots, because as we do this, the roots can spread out easier. Yeah. It's that nice, good soaking, guys. Don't be scared. Don't be shy. Add all of your water. <laughs> it's, like a two gallon tank. it's a two gallon tank guys so about two gallons is good what we put guys is a gallon and a half of water right, you see the measurements are on your, on your... right here yeah they're measurements um 10 rounds um 
Um, <laughs> um, seven liters here, and then two gallons here. <laughs> and one and a half. Uh, one, one and a half. One, uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> 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 you guys <are> <laughs> Okay guys, so our mom is planning um, outdoor gravel. We can make me so we can put our thing to your um, garden bed. these bricks to do the trimming on um, the avocado tree. Okay. On the avocado tree, we put some um, red bricks underneath it to create this beautiful um, circle around the tree. I think it looks really nice. It can also like maybe like um, um, enclosure it a little and um, make it hold some heat maybe. I don't know. But um, we're gonna be having some mulch. Um, gonna that, um, I think, I can't remember if it's gonna go inside or if it's gonna be on the outside. But this is how the tree looks. Let me stand a little for like that. This is how our avocado tree looks right now. It's beautiful and um, we actually got really lucky with this tree because we've been having avocados almost like um, once a year now. Not once a year, but like every year now. We're having large amounts of avocados. So yeah, stay tuned guys to see how our avocado tree will turn out.